Hi, in this video series I'm going to uh, show you the build, how to build and review the GB130 I received for review for, from Gearbest. So let's start by unboxing everything they have sent me. So this is the bag and let's see everything inside. Okay, so let's start. First of all, we're getting these ESCs by BLL. They are 10 amperes and support between one to three cells. LiPo, so we have four of them. We're also getting these four uh, motors by Emax. These are very high quality motors. These are 1306, 4000 kV. And they are designed to work with three inch propellers. I have their bigger brothers and they are very very good high quality motors. So we have four of them. We're getting two counterclockwise and two clockwise. The only difference is the uh, rotation of the thread. So when you fly it, it will auto tight the uh, propeller. So it's a good thing to have. This is the transmitter we're getting. It's 48 channels to the transmitter and it's adjustable between 25 milliwatt to 600 milliwatt. Getting one set of three inch, three leaf propellers. I recommend to order more of them because you're going to break them. So we're getting one set clockwise and one set counterclockwise. AOMA antenna, we're getting one. So this one is RP SMA. This is the camera, FAV camera, Runcam Swift. Also very good camera. I have it on another quad, which I fly. We get in, this is the black version. We get in this SP3 racing flight controller. It comes with all the connections and also the pins are not soldered. I don't think I'm gonna use those. And I do recommend you to get a couple of these standoffs. It will help you with future builds and also maybe in this one. This is the RX-130 frame. Let's have a look at all the components. They get in this 5 volt BDC. This is the frame itself, looks very sweet. Let's just open it up. This is the frame itself. Full carbon. 130 millimeters. This is the PDB with an XT60 connector. You're not getting any LiPo battery in this set, so you need to buy it as well. And you're also getting this standoff for the frame and all these 2.5 millimeters screws. Tune in for the next video because we're going to start building this 130 quad